Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So round two of the Red Goblin Arena is over. I did go for the five star, so we're going to find out together whether I got him, and I'm hoping that I did. I have not looked at any of my messages or anything like that, so we're going to take a look at it together, all right? So let's go ahead into the arenas. And I haven't started my arena grind yet for this new arena. All right, let's go. Okay, four star, and I see him peeking around the corner. Got the five star red goblin, rank 54. All right, um, let me see, what else, what else we got? Three star, just did the uh, milestones. Same thing with the four star, okay. No surprises there. Let's start with the four star basic, which was Morning Star. And pretty much everyone that you're going to see here on this list got the champion. Uh, it's percentage based, so many more people got it. Uh, now, the last time we were looking at this, I got her and I put up just a little bit more than. Uh, the milestones. I think I finished like one extra fight or something like that and got her. Now the thing about the older, uh, the round one arenas is we were experiencing some issues with that arena, which I'm pretty sure um, affected the uh, cutoffs. So uh, I'm not surprised if she went a little bit higher than she did uh, round one. Uh, and just a tip, if you are going for a champion, never ever put up less than what they went for round one. Always assume that they're going to go higher round two by a good amount. So in the four star basic, uh, if the champion went for, say, you know, 1.6 million, I would put up no less than 2 million. And... I've never missed a champion. Now, I don't go for the basics anymore because I'm always going for them when they are featured, and I have all of them. So as soon as a featured champion comes around, I do that, get them as a featured champion, and then I'm done. All right, we'll take a look at that. Take a look at the three-star. Asmodeus, what? Number one. We're number one. All right, and let's see who may have wanted the uh, three star. Now, I'm very curious uh, to hear what scores people are even putting up because there's no longer a reason to put up more than the milestones in the three star arena. Unless you're progressing and you just want to get extra battle chips and gold and things like that, then sure. But I'm just curious because of a recent change, which I love, in all of the featured arenas. So that's the three star featured, the four star featured, and the five star featured. When you get the milestones, the top milestone reward is the three star featured champion. Only the four star basic doesn't have the three star featured um, as the top milestone. So I no longer have to do that since I would only do that to get the uh, three star, because I just like to collect. And uh, so this particular change was really great for me. I loved it, loved it, loved it, loved it. So I get him about three times every arena because I'm always doing the milestones. So I'm getting lots and lots, and they're gonna be, um, yeah, good signature level. All right, and top 200, there we go. All right, now, four star uh, featured. Now, I just went for the milestones because I was going for the five star uh, this round, but I did get the four star round one. So I now have him at all the ranks, uh, all the tiers, except for a six star. I don't even know if he um, comes in the flavor of a six star. I think I saw him as a six star. But uh, I can awaken him if I really want to. Apologies if I missed your name. Uh, Dark Lord, congratulations. Um, if I missed your name, I'm sorry. Uh, just leave a comment. 
I just came back from uh, picking up my stepsister from the hospital. Uh, she's doing all right, but they weren't able to find out why her heart seems to be um, irregular. And on the way back, she wanted to get some food. And she was going to go for fast food. And we were like, no, because she's diabetic. And she needs to learn how to start eating. Um, she put on way too much weight. Coat hanger, congratulations. Um, Dr. Chaotic, congratulations. So we were already going to go shopping today. And she needed to pick up some medication at a Walmart. So that's where we went. We didn't know she was going to shop. Every time I've shopped with her, it's been the exact same thing that happens. Uh, she'll pile up that cart, and then there's always some issue with her card. Either she gave him the wrong card, or she didn't actually have the money on the card. And then one time, she actually had to uh, call up my friend, who they were married at the time, and uh, at work, and ask him to um, send the money over so that she could uh, finish getting the food and I was there with her. Um, and I was like, wow, that is ridiculous, but it happens every time I've gone out with her. All right. Now for the five star featured and due to a change, everyone that you see here is going to have the champion top 300, get the champion. He went for 32 million round one. I wasn't even trying to go anywhere near that cutoff. So I did what I normally would do in that case, but I wasn't sure because that last arena um, had some issues with the uh, matchmaking and a lot of people decided not to even grind. Black Gamer, congratulations, man. Uh, so I would not have been surprised if the cutoff shot up, but I suspected it would be still relatively low um, because of the top 300. Infinity MJ, congratulations, man. All right. Let's see any other names that we recognize here. All right. And there I am. I recognize that name. All right. So congratulations, Big Blue. Let me tell you what Big Blue does for me. Now, Big Blue has a larger roster, so he can easily put up uh, you know, much higher score than me. He went for the champion round one and got him. He was going for the Duke. Uh, I decided to stop at about 60 million. He looked when, when I was live streaming today, he looked and saw that, um, he was just a little bit more than I was. And so he told me do a round so that I was ahead of him just in case we were the cutoff. He doesn't want to be you know, the one at the cutoff and then me just miss when he's just going for a dupe. So he's always looking out for me that way. But as you can see, we were nowhere near the cutoff. All right. So let's keep going. Had to give a uh, big blue uh, a shout out for that because uh, he, he does that all the time. He just watches and um, if he already has the champion, he just makes sure he's close to me and uh, doesn't go over. Right. And usually it's not a problem because I go for overkill anyway. So it's it's I don't think it's ever happened where I've gotten we both grinded and I got it and he didn't. Black Knight. Congratulations, man. Told you I was going to look for your name. Big Sexy. What it do? Congratulations, man. Yeah. A lot of people getting this champion, man. Months behind. Congratulations. Look at that. Loving it, man. Ribbon to rock. Congratulations. All right. And see if we see anybody else. Now, in this arena, like I said, the top 300 get the champion. So we're only going to get to see uh, the top 200. So just like all the arenas now, Everyone that you're seeing here got the champion. Uh, and more besides. Arafin, congratulations. Arafin 
is a um, a friend of a friend. And uh, I remember he was in an alliance that was well above us. And uh, he uh, was willing to let me uh, get in there, but I had already joined uh, this alliance. Uh, but he was always big and bad. And uh, I grinded, grinded, and I've grown. And I don't know where I fit now uh, with him. But in any case, that is going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video. By the way, with that, I now have even arena teams. So take care and you all have a blessed day.